Have you ever wondered whether there can be a right-angled triangle whose perimeter is one unit and area is also one unit square? This guy has solved a similar problem on a rectangle, so I thought, why not try it out on a right-angled triangle? Assume we have a right-angled triangle where the two shorter sides are labeled as A and B, and the longest side, which is the hypotenuse, is labeled as C. Since the triangle is right-angled, we know from the Pythagoras theorem that A square plus B square is equal to C square. Now, we are given two conditions. The first is that the perimeter of this triangle is 1, which means A plus B plus C is equal to 1. The second condition is that the area of this triangle is 1. Now, for any triangle, the area is calculated as half times base times height. In our case, since the right angle is between the sides A and B, we can treat A as the base and B as the height. So the area becomes half times A times B. And since we are told that the area is 1, half AB equals 1. Now multiply both sides by 2, and we get A times B equals 2. From this equation, we get C equals 1 minus A minus B. Now we substitute this into the Pythagoras equation. We get A squared plus B squared equals 1 minus A minus B whole square. Now this is the identity for P plus Q plus R whole square. Substitute P as 1, Q as minus A, and R as B to get 1 minus A minus B whole square as 1 plus A square plus B square minus 2, A minus 2, B plus 2, AB. So we get A square plus B square equals this whole thing. Oh, look, A square plus B square will get canceled from both sides, and we will be left with 1 minus 2A minus 2B plus 2AB equals 0. But from here, we have A times B is equal to 2. So we plug that in, and we get 1 minus 2 times A minus 2 times B plus 4 equals 0, or 5 minus 2 times A minus 2 times B equals 0. Take 2A and 2B, this side to get 2A plus 2B equals 5. And after dividing everything by 2, we get A plus B equals 5 by 2. Now, go back to the perimeter condition again. We had A plus B plus C equals 1. But now we have found that A plus B is 5 by 2 which means C equals 1 minus 5 by 2. That gives us C equals minus 3 by 2. But this is not possible because a side of a triangle cannot be negative, which means that there is no right-angled triangle that can have both its perimeter and its area equal to 1. Yo fam, that was lit. So good.